be more basic. Among the 13 new teachers joining Gregory this year, Vincent Benitez drew his inspiration to become a teacher from a unique experience. The last thing I ever expected was that I was going to become a teacher. I would never have expected a lot of things, and every chance I took, every question that I asked, that I went seeking an answer for, led to an adventure. One of Benitez's most inspiring adventures was serving in the Army. I didn't know the person I was until I joined the Army. I, I discovered a lot of things about myself that I didn't really know of in, until I had done a lot of things in the service. I matured. I developed a deep appreciation for what we have in this country and for the differences in other places that I have ultimately been in. Being a drill sergeant wasn't something I looked to do. The, the Army Reserve put me into a unit and, and they said, welcome, you're, gonna, you're part of a drill sergeant unit. And what I started to realize was that I was a little different than almost everybody else. I was a little unconventional. And not unconventional like strange unconventional. Unconventional is that I didn't have the same stereotype that you would see in movies and on TV. Um, I was firm. I could be very strict. I could be extremely loud. Um, but I was also... Uh, kind and gentle and all the other things that stereotypically you don't see in drill sergeants, whether they're males or females. And I trained from people who've never seen black people, people who've never seen white people, people from around the world. And I thought, wow, I've got, I've got some kind of a gift here. And so I was like, you know, this might be something that I want to do in my life is become a teacher. And as that grew over the years, that's essentially why I went back to college to become a cell biology teacher. And so here I am now. Benitez's adventure in the military has led to a career as a teacher and a life as a more open person. Be open. Be open to yourself. Be open to what's around you. And don't be afraid to ask the question. And you never know how wonderful things will be in the future if you stay open. This has been Emma Jacobson reporting for JNN.